Today I'll be using Techquipment Small Engine Test Set, the TD200 here at the University of Derby. But before I start using any of the equipment in the lab, I have to put my ear defenders on. The first thing I do is adjust the needle valve which controls the flow rate and the level of water in the casing. I adjust it to the maximum capacity. I then push the throttle up and flick on the on button. Then pull the cord with both hands making sure I'm standing horizontal to the engine set. Now that it's raring to go I turn the needle valve anti-clockwise to adjust the flow rate within the engine and push the throttle back down. I then begin to observe the findings on the screen using TechQuipment's versatile data acquisition system, VDAS. The VDAS software allows me to record experiments and automatic charting which reduces experiment time and any potential errors. I then go over to the screen and press record results which are then saved. I then go and adjust the needle valve again, wait for about 30 to 40 seconds and then record the results. I repeat this process for about 5 times. As you can see the speed is increasing as you adjust the flow rate going through the engine. I am now looking at the impact of the decreased speed turning the valve clockwise. You can see that the engine torque and the speed is dropping. I now have a full set of results and I can close the engine down. To do this all I need to do is twist the switch to off on the engine test set. Thank you for watching this video from Tech Equipment.